Swim Ninja here Monday night with Jonathan D, the new coach of Vienna Woods. Uh, welcome to Division Three. He's a longtime swimmer, longtime coach. Uh, how is it with the new team? Loving every second of it. Uh, this Saturday, you came up with your first big win. I understand that after a rough season last year, this is a big one for the team. Um, did you feel like coming in, the expectations were to be successful right away, or after the season last year, did you have a little leeway? And uh, just the parents were look, parents and kids were looking for a little more fun. There was definitely some leeway. Uh, however, of course, there's always the expectation to win a meet. Hopefully multiple meets. Uh, it's a tough division, so all the meets are going to be close, just like this past weekend. Yeah, you were ranked fourth in your division. Wakefield Chapel's ranked number one. Do you take that into consideration at all, or not really, the rank, uh, pre preseason rankings? It's tough to say because... You know, team, uh, teams, you know, you have kids age up, age down, move. So, I mean, it's, it's tough. It's hard to say. Speaking of that, um, you'll be seeing this team again later on a Saturday morning meet. Uh, do you see this as a pretty good prequel to the meet, or do you think that there's going to be enough fluctuation in times or ages that you're not really looking into this meet too much until you get there one week at a time? a little bit of both. Um, I think it's great to see what VAC's got, and I think it's great for VAC to see what we have. Um, kids are going to step up. Kids are going to go faster throughout the year. So, I mean, you got to see who's on vacation, who's not. It's going to be a, it's going to be fun, though. I know you've got some experience um, with little cross-town rivalries on Saturday mornings and swimming against good friends in high school. Um, is there going to be much of that, or is this a little bit more of an amicable relationship? Oh, there's definitely a cross down rivalry. Everyone's talking about it. You know, it's going to be fun, exciting, and uh, it's not going to be too hostile. I hope it's still friendly. All right, and uh, last question, complete hypothetical here. If your 800 girls happen to win All-Star Relays and you promise to take them somewhere and they said either a Justin Bieber concert or Miley Cyrus concert, where do you go? Uh, probably Bieber because right, he's an artist. All right, man. Congrats again on the win, Thank and have a good much. season, guys.